Hello, I am Dr. Renu Mehtani and today I want to share with you some very simple but very important exercises for maintaining healthy lungs. Nobody wants to have stiff, rigid and fibrous lungs which tends to happen after any major infection. So today we are going to not just breathe but breathe correctly, deeply along with some movements which involve using the muscles that help in breathing. Thus, we'll be able to expand and make our lungs more flexible. Meet Dr. Anjali Vikhe. She will be demonstrating the practices. The first one is belly breathing or abdominal breathing. One can keep the hand on the belly to just feel, but the action is done by the muscles and not by the hands. Breathing out from the mouth for this one, one pulls the belly as in as possible. Inhaling from the nose, we relax the belly. Breathing out from the mouth, pull the belly button in, 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 in. Breathe out from the nose to relax the belly. Exhale from the mouth, pull the belly button in, squeeze it, pull it in. Inhale, relax. Breathe out completely from the mouth, emptying the lungs fully, belly button pulled in. Inhale, the belly relaxes. Now this practice should be done as often as possible. Each of these exercises which we are demonstrating, 10 each, 3 times a day would be the best recommendation. And of course you can do much more. Now the next practice is the rib cage or thoracic breathing where we use the inner edge of the hands. Okay, And the hands are kept by the sides on the lower rib and the breathing is all from the nose. Breathing out, the hands squeeze the ribs in. Inhaling, the ribs push the hands out. Continue. Exhale. Press the ribs with your hands. Inhale. The ribs push the hands out. Very nice. Breathe out. Squeeze the ribs with the inner edge of your hands. Inhale. The ribs push the hands out. Exhale. Squeeze the hands into the ribs. Inhale. The ribs push the hands out. And we move ahead to the third practice. Now here we stretch the ribs and the muscles as we breathe. So inhaling the arms go up and she is breathing till her hands have gone up. Breathing out the hands come down. She is breathing out till they have come down. If you want you can do this breathing out from the mouth for this particular one. Breathe in from the nose as the hands go up, 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 up. Breathe out from the mouth to bring your hands down by the side. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Come on, inhale nicely, taking your arms up. Breathe in till your arms go up and breathe out as you bring your hands down. Great. Same breathing pattern, but now the arms will move in the front and open out to the sides to expand the ribs from the front. So, breathe in, stretch the arms out, open the chest nicely. And breathing out, bring the hands in front as if you want to hug someone. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Inhale, exhale, nice and we 
bring the hands down. The next involves little forward bending so that we are able to empty the lungs better. So breathing in, the arms go up, inhale the similar deep inhalation and as you breathe out, forward bend, hands come down from the sides. Breathe in, lifting up, arms also go up. Breathe out, as you forward bend, hands come down from the side. Breathe in, you are breathing in till the end of the stretch. Breathe out and empty your lungs, nice and complete. So that now when you breathe in, coming up, yes, you fill up your lungs nicely and fully. One more time, breathe out as you bend down, completely emptying your lungs. And fill up fresh air as you inhale. Wonderful. And now the arms come down. Great. And now chanting. Nothing can beat the benefits of simple chanting. Like the sound of A, ah, the sound of U and the sound of Ma. Basically these three make up OM as a complete word. But when we chant the A, U, Ma separately, the effects are felt deeper in selective part of the lungs. When somebody chants just the A, A like that, the vibrations and the effects on the lung opening are most in the lower part of the lungs. U chanting, middle part of the lung. And the Ma chanting like mm, it's in the upper part of the lungs. So we will be doing three chants of each and when you practice it is so soothing you'll be happier doing it with closed eyes. Okay, you can sit straight, relax your hands. Now we first breathe in. Ah. part of the lungs we do three u chants breathe in Ooh. inhale Ooh. For the upper lungs, three chants of the sound ma. Breathe in. Mm. Breathe in. Mm. more than three times. Enjoy the vibrations, the soothing and the calming effect of the mind too. So with this, wishing all the best of health. Friends, breath is an affirmation of life. Let's use it to our advantage for healthy lungs and overall health. Thank you very much.